Okay, let's start with our global news stories. Uh, ladies, what stories have we got this week? Who started off? I'll start. Uh, my story was more of a news flash than anything else. Mm -hmm. It's about the wonderful and gorgeous Oswald Bolton. Ooh, he's he's very um, gorgeous. He is, isn't he? He's very if I actually saw him a couple of weeks then, weekends ago in a restaurant in central London and he looks really nice. <laughs> Really nice. But anyway, back to business. Um, he's basically opening up a new flagship store in Savoy Row. You know, that's the place to be seen for any sort of tailor. I think he didn't have a store there in 1998, but as you would know, he went bust in 1998. Wow. But what's so fantastic about him, he's managed to bounce back and he's opening up another store, um, which should be launched in the next few months. Good um, and he's also planning an international expansion sort of plan for his boutiques. He's got um, the USA, Middle East, Russia, India, China and Singapore oh. all over locations which have been cited for his expansion. I mean, so, throughout the bus, he's always had a strong demand, hasn't he, for his products? He has, he has. I mean, he's about 39. I mean, I really look up to him. I admire him, as, apart from the fact that he's gorgeous. Um, <laughs> You know, he started out when he was just 23, apparently. He started selling clothes in um, London's Portobello Road. Um, and I said he went bust in 1998. He's managed to bounce back. And I think, as we all know, I think that's one of the main, that's one of the main skills to Absolutely. acquire in business, the, the, the bounceability factor, you know, Absolutely. the ability to come back, come back stronger, you know. Absolutely. It's, it's, it would, have been a per it would have been a perfect opportunity for him to have a pity party mm. in 1998, but he's used that in instead to fuel his ambition and his drive, and now he's bigger and better than ever. Mm. Um, I, mean, so, yeah. I think it's fantastic. I think you're absolutely right, Abs, which is in business, you've got to be able to bounce back. Yeah. Not every day is going to be great, you know, yeah. and you're going to get knockbacks, yeah. and you're going to have days where the cash flow is not right, yeah. and the client says no, and all yeah. of that. So I think good on him. Good on him. Mm. And as you think about the industry that he's in, we're talking about, you know, tailoring here. You can imagine what his competition is like yes, and yes. despite that he's become one of London's most thought-after tailors yes. I just think he's done so well he you has know, pat on the back for Mr Botan absolutely absolutely well we say good luck to him that's what absolutely. we say absolutely great yeah. stuff um, who else